hey everyone welcome back to this channel so today i'm going to create this portfolio website with light and dark mode i know you have already watched that video and there is no point of explaining everything from start so i will provide you the link in the description or in the card section and so what we do today is that we have created a light and dark mode and uh, added in this portfolio okay and there is no need to worry just uh, around five to six lines of css and two to three lines of js code okay? we just need this much so when i click here you can see uh, we just move to the light mode and the icon changed also and when i click again it moved to dark mode and the icon changed again so yeah we have to create this uh, thing today and uh, let me just show in the uh, so in the responsive you can see here we can see the icon and the logo when i click on the icon you can see everything changes and yeah it's look amazing in my views but i don't know about yours so just comment to me how it's like okay and when i click yeah it's fully responsive as you can see and yeah everything works fine so yeah let's start this video with an intro guys i have already created that video and uh, how to make this portfolio website and now i'm going to add the dark mode here so for that just let me add something yeah and um, let's add the dark mode icon so here i'll just add dark mode and here let's paste the icon as you can see here a moon icon is present now now let's go back to style.css and let's type it so let's select dark mode and i will set a uh, cursor to pointer and font size will be 2 rem okay and yeah, now it's look fine and let's add a hover effect so when i hover it will change color okay so just go here and yeah this looks best okay now everything set here but i have to change the design and everything when i click here okay so let's do it step by step so let's come here and add a script tag because we are going to adding a script here so just type here and add a function that is uh, light dark mode okay after that uh, let's add the uh, that uh, icon that is uh, i'm going to add that uh, named as dark mode and let me just uh, use the document query selector and i will just select the icon then let's select the all the elements that we want to change uh, the color and everything so i will just tell you step by step how we can do that so yeah body and section and the nav link okay that is nav a then move to here and i have to toggle the images and everything also so let's add the dark mode of class this to toggle and i will toggle the um, class name because i have already uh, selected the uh, icon and we have to just change the icon name so in the when i click on that um, that moon it will just change the i think something went wrong yeah here we have to add the functionality so when i click on moon it just changed to the sun and when i click on sun it changed into moon let me just show you so when i click it you can see uh, it changes to sun and then moon okay now what we have to do is that um now when i click on moon it will just move to the light mode and when i click on sun it will just move to dark mode so for that let me just adjust here so here i'm going to use dark mode and dark mode uh, yeah dark mode is circular it will change this color also because when i in the light mode the uh, icon no, uh, icon we can't see the icon because it is in the white uh, color okay so we have to change the color of the icon also so what i am doing is that i am using ternary operator for that and after that uh, when i just click on uh, that uh, moon icon it will just change the color to uh, white 
sorry i'm black okay so we can't see it because uh, as you can see in the background color is black and uh, we have to add the functionality to change the background color and everything okay so just uh, here uh, our work is finished now just now we have to move to the style.css and add some uh, class names so that we can use toggle for that so, so just go here and type body dot i am going to use class uh, mode uh, sorry dark mode class and i am used for everything that is body section navy section okay and what i am doing is that uh, i am going to change the uh, color to black and background color to white okay and after that everything is finished now now we have to just add this functionality here so i will just select each element okay for that just come here and write elements dot for each element uh yeah for each okay so do, yeah for each element uh, i think this uh, creates a function so I'll just remove this one and yeah sorry for that uh, we have to just use to select all because we are selecting all the uh board uh, all the uh, elements like body section and nav okay then go here yeah now we can add the elements so just come here and type element dot uh, class list okay. element dot class list dot toggle and what we are toggling is that uh same the class name of the before okay jo that we have created earlier okay so yeah dark mode class and refresh the page as you can see this one yeah this one okay so now let's click again and see what changes we are doing so you can see everything changes right and we are just created a dark mode function in our portfolio website so i think it's a great idea and uh, it's a very good uh, technique to use that and uh, i think you have to use this dark mode also and i will also i have already uh, explained how to create this portfolio website